Guys, how are you? I'm here with Casey. Hello. Casey is rocking the Kristen Stewart look I created for the Rolling Stones video, Ride Em On Down. It's looking good. It's amazing. I believe I ride them on down. Well, I don't stop I believe I ride on down. So let's get crazy with Chanel right now. Come with us. So everything in this look is supposed to look like you just like woke up, smeared stuff on, and then like went out the door. This is the apocalypse, like no one's left. So just keep that in mind when we're doing this. So we created this eye with two pencils. Um, I used the Chanel, the straight up precision eye definer in noir black. And then I also used ebony in the, the waterproof version. So we kind of just rim this all over the eye. You can see there's a natural line right here and that's how far we brought it up. And then we filled that in. And we weren't too concerned with shape, we were just really concerned with kind of the mess of it all. And then we take a blending brush and we just blend that in the crease. And you can see it kind of takes those lines away. And we just blend like the whole thing. It almost looks like a shadow, but it has a nice tackiness to it. So whatever we put on top of it is going to stay. Perfection. Okay, so next we're gonna take that waterproof liner. I'm gonna rim the inside of her eye. She's been to this rodeo before because usually people are like, oh. We want the lash line to be the darkest and the grittiest because that's what makes blue eyes really pop. Or in your case, hazel eyes. Mm -hmm. And now I'm gonna fill in the bottom water rim and I'm actually gonna rim it all along your lashes too. And then I also went on the traditional upper lash line just to have it be the darkest at the lashes. And then I just took a little brush, like a liner brush, and kind of just blended this. So now we've kind of laid the entire eye down and now we have to get grittier with it and darker with it. So first we're gonna put on a shadow. This is the Los Hombres TC Smoky 246. And we use this black right here and I had a, I actually dropped this and this really pretty silver broke. So I won't be bringing it home for the holidays. <laughs> the other color I used was this gray. So I kind of placed the gray right in the middle of the eye and then blended that. And then I went in with the black. So I picked it up with the brush and then I kind of just blended it all over the eye. And again, I don't want this to look super neat, so having a little bit of jaggedness to it is super cool. All right. We don't care about anything here. <laughs> We're gonna break stuff. Now we have this perfect smoky eye, but we needed to add like kind of this like pop so that the cameras would pick up on it and also would be a little bit messier, like wetter. I actually used their Hydra Beauty Lip Balm. It's a nourishing lip balm. These are the tricks of the trade, people, okay? And then I took a very little bit of the, I love this, this like kind of glittery so black creamy liner and mix this with the Hydra. I know it sounds crazy, but you get this really pretty wet, so pretty tarry like substance and it's kind of bomb. So I just pressed it like right in the middle of the eye just to give a little texture. And then I kind of rimmed it along the bottom too to mess it up a little bit and just give it a little wetness. Next, what I did, we didn't do any lashes. We just threw in Le Volume de Chanel, number 27. And it's kind of got like a whininess to it. Like it's a black wine. You can see it, yeah. You can see it, right? It looks like a blackberry or something. A blackberry, exactly. Sometimes when you have a black eye and everything's black, it kind of gets 
So if you lose dimension, this kind of just breaks things up a little bit, so it's not so solid black. The shame in this is that I'm probably gonna like go grocery shopping. I know. It's gonna go to waste. <laughs> We're gonna buff on the Ultra Wear Flawless Foundation, and I buff this all over the skin, and this just gives a really like even, not too dewy, but not too matte look, and I want you to still look like kind of wet and a little rugged. It doesn't feel very heavy either. It doesn't. No. This makeup lasts all day. So when you're working on music videos, you want, that's why we do the layering, and we want things to last and organically move. So the eyes, we wanted to be like, just real, you know? And the face, we didn't want to have to touch up a million times. So you can feel how it's already has that beautiful staying power. Then I did take a little bit of the Soleil de Chanel, which is like this beautiful bronzer, and buffed on her cheeks just a little bit. And it's just like this nice nude color. We did want to get a little bit of sheen on the face. You can mix it with foundations and stuff. It's like this illuminating base, but I just used it and kind of just, again, kissed it on the, the high ends of the cheekbone and then a little bit on the, on the airplane. <laughs> I'm taking a little bit of blush, but not too much. This is number 68, Rose Ecrin. I don't normally do this, but again, for the video, we wanted the skin to be super dewy and like natural. Again, like, like not trying. So traditional rules of makeup are kind of going out the door. So this is kind of this like wet, illuminated cheek and then just give me a little smile, not too much. And then I kind of just threw a little of this on top. I feel like I'm that guy who used to do Bob Ross. Little trees. <laughs> Little trees right here, blush, just a little color, <laughs> just to kind of just you know look natural. <laughs> just gonna be Jamie Ross. I took a teeny bit of the powder. Anywhere there was like a little bit of extra shine that we didn't want, we just kind of did the T zone. This is the best part of the look. I finished the look with it. This is the Rouge Coco Shine, and I used Boy. This is like a super nude. Oh my God, it's so amazing. It's cool, right? It's so amazing. Cause there's like so much going on, but it doesn't look like I've really tried. So we couldn't just end the video there. No way. We had to ride them on down, right? <laughs> so let's, let's go ride them on right. down. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs>